In normal times during a pandemic, the CDC will do briefings or during an outbreak of something just to inform the general public. That is traditionally what the CDC does. And you will notice that there have been no briefings really by the CDC uh, throughout the last few months, which is not really, not really how it normally works. And after that, it was decided that the, the messaging really needed to be locked down because they didn't want you know, they wanted to be very careful about what was being relayed to the public. That was also around the time when the stock market plummeted for the very first time. And they were certainly keeping tabs on that. And, you know, the president has run on a platform that's jobs and economy. And that was, that was where their mindset was at. So the VP gets tasked to lead this task force and you see the press briefings commence and you see our com shop and they really cracked down. They said nothing goes out without us reviewing it. No guidances, no policies. That's where you start to see a little bit of the, the control of what the public health community is putting out, what they're telling the public about this virus. Because the data is not really fitting the narrative that everything's okay, that everything's getting back to normal. And then you see doctors not show up at the briefings. And then you see Dr. Fauci not show up at all. And the truth is, I mean, they were manipulating who was going in front of the press briefings on purpose because they wanted to really crack down on what was being said to the American people. And we weren't being necessarily forthcoming.